Before this video starts, I gotta give a quick little sponsor and shoutouts to questionable Mr. Game Guy123. And last but not least, Streamer John22, aka PS4 Gamer. This is him and he has officially returned. AKA PS4 Gamer. So please go subscribe to Streamer John22 and so you can redeem himself and show him your massive support. This is actually PS4 Gamer, so please. Go subscribe to him and show him your massive, massive support, along with the other two I just showed you in the beginning. Other than that, enjoy the stream. I mean the video, sorry about that. So it's been confirmed later this month we might get a rumored Nintendo Direct, which actually might happen or not, but that's okay. These are my opinions and thoughts about what we might see and what we, what we might not. Other than that, let's get into the themes I want to see in the Nintendo Direct. Alright, the first one is the Batman Arkham Trilogy. We received a rumor about Batman Arkham coming to the Switch, and I believe me, I really want to try my hands on the Arkham game so, so badly. And seeing these ported to the Switch is very fantastic. I don't care if they look a little bit downgraded, but I really, really want to play Arkham on the Switch for the first time. Alright, the next one is Breath of the Wild 2, Mo like, information and new stuff, like how the development is going and stuff. Even if we don't get any updates on it, then that is okay. I respect A.G. Onuma's manners. So yeah. But hey, if we don't get any updates, it'll be fine. Alright, the next one is a quick advertisements for Sonic Frontiers and seeing how it will look on Switch. And it'll be okay if it's a little downgrade as well. Of course, the other rumored thing we were going to get is Game Boy games. And I'm just very excited to see these come to the Switch. And that way, things could get a lot more better. Also, here's an idea I have. You can always download it so you can play the games offline without an internet connection. While still subscribed to the description. Just like how PlayStation and Xbox did with their games. Where you can just download the classic games and something like that. We might hopefully see something like that in the future, but we'll have to wait and see. Alright, the next one I want to see is Battlefront 2, and believe me, this is on every single Star Wars fan's list. After we saw Force Unleashed, it would be very, very, very awesome if we see Star Wars Battlefront come to the Nintendo Switch. Since the EA version is too powerful to be on it, maybe or not, but hey, I would love to see this game come to the Switch. Other than that, I think we have one more. Everyone's talking about the new games and stuff, but I'm surprised no one talks about the Amiibos. Like, there are still a few Smash Amiibos we still want to see in, like, the series. Like, we got Minecraft Steve and Alex and Min Min, but the only few fighters we need are Sephiroth. Crap, forgot the other one. Sephiroth, Kaizua, and of course Sora himself as an Amiibo. And probably some more Amiibos for future games as well, because I really, really, really want to see more Amiibos. Other than that, that should be about it for today. Like, even if we're still trying to discover some stuff, like, there's some other games I can easily come up with, like, a rumored Banjo-Kazooie Redemption, but I'm not sure about that part. Or a new Mario game. But other than that, hope you guys like this video, subscribe for more, and I'll see you guys in the next video, so peace out.